there's a very specific feel to these type of games. And if you've ever played them, you know exactly what I'm talking about. I'm assuming this is the hall of Kickstarter beggars, by the way. Bones do some damage. Yeah. I threw bats at those bats, but it didn't work. God damn it. There's my back step. Wait, what was that? Wait, what was that? Was that the fucking thing I need to murder for the thing? Samnok! Ah! Oh, I have to kill more of you! I need you so I can get a pizza! How's that bring it in? That's pretty good. Ah! Oh, I have to go get my pizza! The Minotaur is less sexy than the Kraken, but I'm still in. Yeah, the monster designs are really cool. I have to get back before I die. Oh god, my HP is... Thorn Rope's actually super effective. Crunch. If I go back with my brigandine juice, or my sabnock juice, should I get this game? I'm mighty tempted. I mean, do you like this style of Castlevania game? Because, yes, if so, this is that. It's coming out on Switch next week, so I mean, maybe that appeals to you more? I definitely like the idea of this being portable, but, I mean, you know. Castlevania is fun, yeah. I mean, yeah, if you were a fan of the uh, Metroidvania style ones, pick this up. Because it's fucking. It's sweet. Monster Bird Tear. Ugh, stupid bats. This is awesome. Oh, we made it. Got any targets for me? Here's what I've turned up on. Good work. So, I, is the brigandine worth three pizzas? Oh, God. That's good armor. What do the convex glasses do? I might want to wait on the pizza. I can just buy the damn glasses, I think. Hello, Miri. What are you looking to buy? Or can I? Thank you. Or can I? Now that I, you know what, let's go save first because my controller won't stop vibrating. You like Castlevania or thick as fuck pirate elf girls? Ah, we found another game that I didn't think Mike would enjoy, but he can't stop masturbating to. <laughs> So hang on, if I um if I take off the hat but I go the baz. Does it still do it for you, Mike? Does the baz still do it for you? Thick pirate elf girls. How do you feel about the baz? I don't think I can go Baz Pirate Hat. No, the Pirate Hat overrides the Baz. I mean, it's not a total deal breaker. <laughs> you whore. Yeah! 
Um, can you make the brigandine now that I have it? Tonight. Fuck you. So, what'll it be? No. So what is this again? Nine two two. Oh God. I'm so torn. Sir Johannes. Yes. She's risked much to help us. This probably sees his role play. For example, she arranged for the galleon that took us here. And she gave us use of one of her homes. That was where you first woke up. Why would she be so kind? I don't know. But she seems interested in alchemy. She even helped me develop the right that stopped the crystal from overtaking you. As far as I'm concerned, she took us in after the guild's destruction when no one else would. And has allowed me to continue in my research. We owe her a huge debt. We do. I'm not saying I'd specifically request the mask, but if she brought the mask, it wouldn't stop me. Alright, we're gonna wear the brigandine for a little bit. Because, I mean, look at that. Oh, number go up. Condition good. I wonder if that's what's gonna start getting all fucky when I wind up with a ton of, uh, Shards. Hi, so, what'll it be? An ant shard! I'll go with this. I'll go with this. There we go. I'll go with this. I'll go with this. So, let's see. Um, so I throw more bats, and uh, my bouncing ball of water bounces longer. I'll go with this. Also, now my giant vepper tentacle lasts longer. I'll go with this. I'll go with this. I'll go with this. Yay. I'll go with this. I'll go with this. Probably should have done the splash instead, but whatever. I gotta make the pizza. I need four pizza doughs and two cheeses. To make the pizza dough, I, oh yeah. Come back if things. Yeah, we're gonna just. When I find something better or approximate to the brigandine, we'll do the pizza side quest to get the convex glasses. But that's it's way too nice to like just give it to a lady for some pizza. God, pizza would be delicious right now though. Like, if someone came in and was like, if you give me the shirt off your back, I'll give you a pizza. Like, no questions asked right now. Like, fucking deal. I don't know who you are or why you got my... Hey, when the audio clips replay, that frequently when you do actions and source and such. Yeah. It's not great. Any target. Do you have any new ones? No. Dola Hammers, Gearmans, and Barbatos. I, do I have any of those that I've fought so far? I mean, the Dola Hammers, yeah, but that's it. Let's take a moment to admire Mike's favorite monster, by the way. For those of you who aren't here for the first boss fight. It's a shame there's not a character viewer. There you go, Mike. That was for you, buddy. Uh, let's check out the seeds while we're here. We'll be harvesting in no time. Okay. My condition is still good. How many potions do I have? One? Hang on. <clears throat> that mouth animation. Yeah, some of the NPCs did not get the love that other characters get. Let's buy some potions, you guys. Hello. What can I do for you? What are you looking to buy? Uh, I have one. So Is this right? Four, and we have a deal. Five. Um, Ether, I'm fine on. 
Let's take one of those. Oh, now I can just buy rice balls from her. That's interesting. Now that we've done all that, we're gonna go back and save again because we're right by the save room right now. There we go. Back into the castle. Get our ass kicked. See how big that bone was now? Oh, there's a weird bats. <laughs> oh, those bats are awesome. seat you guys um, comfy oh well, didn't mean to read that dropping mana now. That's kind of ominous. Oh, he does a little kitty roll. Oh! What we got here? Passive shard. This effect will automatically activate when it is equipped. Sword expertise increases single-handed sword and club damage. Ooh. So if I... Faster single-handed sword mace attacks. I don't think that... Qualifies. Oh, it's a katana, yeah, so. Uh. Sort of by attack. So this game classified as genre-wise seems to have RPG elements. It's, um, they call it an Igavania. I guess technically action RPG? Oh, hello. Gale Crawler creates a shockwave that travels across the ground and rips enemies apart. Nice. Iron, Elm, Bronze, and Cotton. I wonder what I can make with that. Uh, 
A uh, thousand blossom. Riddle enemies with a blur of thrust too fast to count. X oh, Ray Pierce Stinger. Kazakhle. Yeah. Leather chest guard. It's trash. <laughs> Oh no, dogs, my bane! Shit! Ah, shit! Oh no, I have to kill the dogs! Die, fart gas! You don't belong in this world. Hold up. saw that coming. What the hell? Hey, what other... Let's see. No. No. I thought it was hitting a secret wall, <laughs> but I guess it just destroyed something that was in the corner. Blood grinder knife. Oh god, he's got a chainsaw sword. Oh god, he was gonna Fred Durst me. Ether. Ether! Sedating Gyre, spin towards enemies and transfer your momentum. Down to away and towards X, good lord. I don't have any of those weapons though. We got down here. Huh. Uh, DXO1764. Whilst attempting to create my homunculus, I discovered a strange formation of white crystal growing on the subject. What is it? A sign at long last that my studies are progressing. I must observe it diligently and learn all I can. The crystal I discovered appears to be multiplying slowly. Its corruption spreads through the cadaver I chose as a subject. It is a marvelous substance, neither entirely liquid nor solid. As soon as I have enough, I shall begin experiments to discover its other properties. Oh. I feel like that's gonna be a thing later. Oh, hi. Right, I guess I did leave the room, didn't I? playing hopscotch. I'll not be defending my actions to you. But don't I deserve it? You were like a father to me. 
Oh, enough, child. I am here for the book. Jeeble has the book. What are you talking about? If you don't already know, then let us keep it that way. <laughs> Alfred, how are you still alive? Oh, what were you thinking of coming here? You can answer my question first. Yeah. All that matters is that I am alive. Did you come here for the book? Book? The Leaper Logiath? Make no mistake. I won't let anyone touch that tome. But me. Not even you should touch it. Didn't what happened ten years ago teach you anything? I don't have time to argue with you. I just hope you are wise enough not to get in my way. Uh, what? You know full well my power exceeds yours. Take Miriam and leave this place. Otherwise, you will die. Okay. I came here because something didn't feel right, but I didn't expect him. Johannes, what is the Liebe Logiath? It's... it's a book the Alchemy Guild once possessed that allows for the summoning of spirits. The Guild used it to bring about the Calamity ten years ago, and the Shardbinder's crystal acted as a kind of catalyst. A book like that shouldn't even exist. I know. Alfred must be trying to restore the Alchemy Guild to power, but we cannot let him lay hands on the Lieber Logiath. He said Cheeple had it. You know, I think I might have seen it. It makes sense, considering the situation we're in. He must have gotten his hands on it after surviving the sacrifice. So now I have to stop Alfred, too. No. Let's focus on Jeebel. If we can get to him and the book before Alfred does, we'll kill two birds with one stone. Good point. All right. Dominique might know what to do about Alfred in the meantime. I'll head back to the village and see what she has to say. Deal. Yeah! Uh, I'll drop down. Hey, wait a minute. Since there's a way down. Hmm. Probably an ability I need later. Oh! Hey, save room. That's actually kind of annoying because uh, when I played last night. Save hype! I didn't go down, I went in the room past where Alfred is and died. And lost all the progress. <laughs> No, I know there was a save room right there the entire fucking time! Ah! Or you drop something. Thank you. By the way, if you guys missed Parasite Eve on Monday, uh, it's up on the YouTubes in five parts. Catch up now. Monday, I'm going to be back with the continuation of that. I'm going to keep it on Mondays because it's a shorter game than I thought. Um, and I think Friday night, Mike and I are going to try to play some Monopoly. So if you own Monopoly on the Switch, let us know. God damn. Whoa! 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 Wait a minute! Critical swing. Lash at enemies with a single mighty strike. No, oh, I want that health up! Mm. Fine. Stupid fart monster! Can't get up there yet. He's 
no match for my ability to hurl bats. It's a fucking load room. An old ass Symphony of the Night style load room. That's awesome. Garden of Silence. Look at that weird ass bird. Mocha weed. Okay, it's a weed. True arrow. Loose an arrow in the designated direction. Oh, that might be a good one. Excuse me. Let's take a look at that. Shards. Is it directional? Yeah, that's a good one. Holy shit. That is also good. Everything is good. It's all amazing. Mocha oil and mocha lee. Hey, mocha oil was what I needed for the pizza dough. Oh, I can't wait to get a double jump. Uh, let's check down first. A war horse's key is required to enter this boss. <laughs> Recipe. Oh, it's a recipe for uh, Johannes. Oh god, it's that Fred Durst guy again. Oh no. Uh, he telegraphed the shit out of it and I still got hit. Like, he literally pointed at me and cranked up his sword. Beast Beret! Oh no, is this the end of... It is, the numbers go up. Now I'm a weird uh, elf cami. The numbers go up, you guys. And when the numbers go up, we can't say no. Number get bigger. Fancy a ride, milady. Oh no. Why? Are you offering one? <laughs> I could take you someplace most interesting. The rub, of course, is that obstacle standing squarely on our path. See? <sighs> I doubt I would be able to push it aside. A shame you don't have a giant hand. Ah. The wild and crazy things one could do with a giant hand. Guys, I think we're gonna get a giant hand. Yeah! Shooting it with arrows was not the answer. Alright, I will return when I get the requisite giant hand power. 